Meteorologist Corey Repenhagen took Storm Tracker 7 across state lines chasing this weekend storms. 14 people killed in those storms when the tornado hit the town of Mayflower, Arkansas, just to the northwest of Little Rock. You never think that it's going to happen to you, ever. Cleanup is underway here in Mayflower, and residents have returned to the scene. Brandy Benson surveys the damage. We got here, and while well, we're just rallying around our family, trying to help them as best we can. Mayflower is all her family has ever known. That's her grandmother's house right there with heavy damage. That's her dad's place next door, and her brother's house heavily damaged as well. 86-year-old grandma was home when the tornado struck, along with her cousin. He laid on top of her, and she's okay. Thank God, she's okay, she's with my aunt. And then more good news. A local journalist finds something in the rubble. It's her daughter's school picture, once proudly displayed inside grandma's house. She's gonna be happy that we found it for her, so, and it's a blessing that we found this. She didn't want us to see the picture, but we could see how much it meant to have it back. You know, Mike, this is why it's so important to have accurate warnings, and Storm Shield works right. anywhere in the country. This is the beginning of severe weather season. It's moving our way as the year goes on. You've got to get this valuable app right now. No question about it. Mike, thank you.